Yo, what's going on guys? It is Fox United here. Welcome back to a brand new episode of the Arsenal RTG for you guys today here on the channel. Today, we are here for, um, well, packs to start with actually. If you end up enjoying the video though, drop it a like, subscribe to the channel if you're around here as well, uh, as I am continuing uh, my journey of diseaseness. Um, but first things first, I actually don't have a preview pack, so we're not opening the preview pack. Uh, we have got a couple of packs here that we need to fly on through. So we're going to start things off with a 75 plus rare rated gold player. And it's going to give me... Don't know who you are. Don't care who you are. Right, we're going to go with the rare gold pack. That was an 81 uh, gold rare or above. It's going to be Brazilian, CDM. Is that going to be Fernando? Yes. In the plus side though, I'd take the Hunter and the and the Shadow in the pack. That's probably the best thing what this thing's got. And Feldcamp. Next up, the Mega Pack. Hopefully we can try and get some decent coinage. Uh, but I mean, it's an Italian set of back. You're just going to know it's a Serbian. You're just quick, Zella, because you don't really get all Romagnoli. It's the same thing. Yes, Klopp. Right, we've got an 80 plus times 5. Let's see what we can get out of this then. It's going to be Senegalese, Striker. Is that going to be Dia? Man, I packed him like five times during the previous episode. Um... So that's pointless. I mean, Lamar was technically better, so I just got frauded. Right, 81 plus times two. Coming up hot. German. Cam. Bayern. Either Musiala, uh, the woman, or Muller. And it's Muller. It's 84 rated, so it's decent. It's decent enough. We take it. And Jordan Pickford. Right, 82 times two. What you got for me? It's going to be uh, Gvardiol. No, it's not. It's going to be Orban. It's still not good. I'm sure he's 82. Oh, he's 83. I've already got him in the club, apparently. Uh, I'm just going to quick sell him. And then my 84 times 2. Here we go. We've got Spanish. Sentiment. Oh, Parejo. I've already got him in the club. Oh, no, I don't. I must have used him for the icon pack there. My, my mistakes. Okay, so for today's episode, I'm basically actually going to activate uh, William Saliba's evolution and complete it. So with Martinelli's um, evolution, this is how we're getting on so far. Um, we have won four... Uh, we've won one... Uh, game uh, of squad battles or rivals using the Evo. I've done all the assists with Martinelli, hence why that would have been done in squad battles. And of course, achieving the three clean sheets, um, we've done the one of the three. So the plan with Martinelli is I'm going to do most of Martinelli off camera um, in terms of just going into squad battles and getting the clean sheets. That will leave me then with just one more win that I need, which hopefully then I can involve him in this, uh, you know, in a live gameplay. With this lead one, if I manage to win the three games in a row, like convincingly, I mean, this one is win by at least two goals. It's a little bit trickier. But if we can do this all in one, um, then I'll just do a Martinelli off camera and then evolve both Saliba and Martinelli at the same time. So we're going to activate Saliba. So we're on to him. We're then going to go to our team. This is just for objective of something else. So uh, you don't need to worry about this. We're going to go over to our main team, though, which is the Guna squad. Um, by the time I've, uh, oh, whilst I'm making this video, I haven't actually uploaded yet um, what I personally thought, uh, what you guys thought. Uh, with regards to me using my fun team a bit more in the episodes. So I still don't have a clue what you guys are thinking. Uh, and that's kind of absolutely fine. Actually, Zinchenko's already in the right spot. It doesn't matter. Um, so yeah, I actually don't have a clue what you guys think in terms of if I use my fun team more with like Mirham and stuff in there or, or not. So I'll wait until I see that. Well, this guy's team, it looks like he doesn't want to skip. Lorente, absolute shock. Muller, shock. But he's got a Bamiang as well, so that's going to be interesting to see what he does with him. You just can't beat Alex Scott in a race. It's just not possible. She is the GOAT. Allow it. Lovely goal there, straight off the bat. Bukayo Saka making it 1-0. Now, remember, we need to win by at least two goals. So, you know, he's not exactly going to be bad as well. He's, he knows what he's doing. But Saliba's just going to drop him on his fucking forehead. Like, do you know what I'm saying? That composure from Saliba then is just... You can't stop that. You just can't. That's great play. And I think that's him gone. I think he's had enough already, mate. And that's... Yeah. Good. GG's, mate. Lovely bit of play there. Put a lot of power on that as well for Aubameyang. And yes, I am a Traveller rat. What are you going to do about it? Let's be honest. you got to do what you got to do around here, innit? But hey, Jesus picking up uh, a goal and an assist, I believe. Uh, no, it wasn't. Uh, yeah, so, no, it wasn't. Uh, Aubameyang and uh, Saka with the goals. Jesus with two assists uh, on that side. Um, yeah, it's job done. Well, on the evolution side of things, that was the first one done for William Saliba. So he's now up to an 84 uh, raid card with three passing, one dribbling, one defending, and one physical. Now has high defensive work rates. Not that I don't think he did in the first place. 
Now all we need to do is just win two games. It doesn't matter by what goals it is. And play one game. So let's go do them. Oh, I'm seeing a guy with Wayne Rooney. I'm having flashbacks to when he absolutely bummed me that one time. He scored like eight goals. Zinni. Brett. Um, I'll be very, very honest with you. That's not a penalty in the absolute slightest. Um, so I'm just going to stay down the middle. And if he stays down the middle, fair enough to him. All right. It's not a pen, though. Lads, my guy's got Kyle Walker and Mo Salah. What, what, why am I surprised? I just want to apologise. He doesn't have Mo Salah. It's the Wi-Fi password. My apologies. What I'm not apologising for is that goal, though. Because that's sexy. <laughs> He's just dashboarded. <laughs> Sweet. Right. We move. This is getting really simple. Oh, maybe a bit of space now. Oh my god, how's he made that tackle before I could shoot? Oh my... Oh, that's bullshit. Oh, no it's not. No, uh, oh my... Wow, okay, let's just relax for two seconds while I compose what just happened and how I'm not 1-0 down. This is what we like to call a major problem for me. That's goal. Yeah, alright, fair enough. Yeah, this guy's a much better opponent than I am. Uh, I don't really see me doing too much in this. I mean, he's going to make it too, isn't he? Yeah, all right. Respectfully, uh, he's better than me. I'm just going to leave. I'm so glad that Sleeber has just minced Mo Salah there. Because the amount of times I see this stupid idiot in my fucking games does me head in. Nice. That'll get me in front. Please leave. Be very satisfying. Thank you very much. I uh, very much appreciate you being in my game. Well, with that being said and done, we can go ahead and officially complete William Saliba's evolution for today's episode. He has now got 85 pace, 88 defending, 86 physical. He's even more sexier and he's got intercept plus. So we now have an incredible uh, centre back that's even better. Um, with Martinelli, like I said, I'm going to go off camera now and achieve the three Excuse me, the three clean sheets. Once I've done the three clean sheets, we'll go back, try and play into another game, and then win uh, with Martinelli, obviously, in the team. So you can just, obviously, you know, have some fun. Okay, so like I said, I have done a bit of grinding off camera, uh, and I've completed all the active clean, or achieved the clean sheets uh, in Squad Battles or Champions uh, with Gabriel Martinelli. We've done the assists with Martinelli, which means the last thing that we need to do to fully evolve this Martinelli and to get the whipped pass playstyle added to him is to just win a game, which we're going to try and do in Rivals. So this is where we are. This is where we're heading. Let's go try and get it. Everyone seems to want to see teams. Oh my God, you've got first owner Kelly Smith. I hate you. What I would do to have a first owner Kelly Smith in my club. No, don't make that sound like I'm horny over Kelly Smith. All right. She's a gooner and that's all that matters, you know. And an early goal would certainly settle any nerves. All right, I will sprint past you with these. Oh, you bastard. Oh, this fucking game is going to do my head in. I'll genuinely, I will go and do the Martinelli win in squad battles and it's going to piss me off this much. How is that going in? There we go. For God's sake. Ugh. Right. Stop BSing me, game. I swear down. I'll hurt your family and get a chance to pass it. There we go. There we go. In front now. Nice one from Saka. A little bit scrappy. Uh, but hey, let's talk about his goal. Uh, you know, less said about that. Let's, you know. Take too long with it, my friend. You will suffer for taking too long with it. There we go. Please leave. I would very much appreciate it. Thank you very much, my son. That's all I needed to do. Cool. There we go. We got our Martinelli off. That was just... I don't... Right, I don't mind losing games, right? Put it out there. But sometimes the way that I concede goals, too often I'm conceding them in those dumb formats. But Aubameyang getting an assist. Martinelli picking up two goals. Uh, Jesus with an assist. Saka with a goal as well uh, to round that off. So we're going to go ahead now and claim the second of the two of the evolutions that we have done today and just like that martinelli is complete and we're gonna go ahead and boom check that out that is a lovely lovely looking upgrade there for gabriel martinelli he is complete uh, and he looks brilliant whether i think he'll probably be my main starter i don't think so because personally if we look at the arsenal team now for me the best system that i seem to have at the moment is by having mckay and zinchenko 
playing Zinchenko in its centre mid in uh it, it's just massive and I feel like Martinez would just be such a brilliant impact sub um yeah I know I put Mia Hamm in there I got a bit annoyed when I was trying to do it so I'll, I'll take her out sorry about that um in fact she can just go out of the Arsenal team altogether she ain't a part of it she ain't in that group even though she's you know probably one of the best icons of the game but you know it is what it is big boy Eddie can rock himself in um, so yeah, like tactic wise, this is um, kind of how I, I set up. I'll do like a full, maybe in the next video, um, I will do, oops, I've made a mistake here. Uh, maybe in the next episode, I'll do like a full um, custom tactics video of what I personally run. Bearing in mind, they are mostly just copied off of other people. But maybe if you want to see one, I'll, I'll show you guys. But that's it for this episode of the Arsenal RTG. If you have enjoyed it, drop a like, subscribe if you're new around here as well. I'll catch you guys for the next episode where uh, maybe it'll probably just be some more packs, more gameplay. Uh, and I believe the UCL heroes are coming out. So maybe we could try and see how much it'd be to get Alex Scott. Uh, but also, I want to try and work to try to get uh, or try to afford uh, the ultimate dynasties, Yuri and Timber as well. But for now, I'm out of here. Take care all. Peace.